The team at ITN Productions are pleased to announce that we're partnering with UK Hospitality to create a programme about the future of the industry. And to tell us more, I'm joined by Kate Nichols, the Chief Executive of UK Hospitality. Hello and welcome. Thank you. Very nice to meet you. Um, let's start by talking about this bigger voice that UK Hospitality has now got. You've joined forces. Um, what does that mean for the industry as a whole? Yes, well, we've brought together two of the largest trade associations that represent hospitality to create one strong single voice for the whole industry, from single site independence right the way through to national chains. And the purpose behind that was to make sure that such an important industry, culturally, socially and economically, had the voice it deserved and got the recognition it needed from politicians and the general public. What do you think are the factors behind the fact that the hospitality industry hasn't just survived the downturn, it's actually on the up? It is on the up, despite some of the challenges and the headwinds that we've gone through. I think that's partly because we're very close to customers, we're very responsive to consumer need. And also, what we don't get credit for is that we're a hugely innovative and dynamic sector that has changed out of all recognition over the course of the last five years, directly as a result of what our customers are telling us they want us to do. You say you're close to the customer, but actually it's also perhaps in part to the new generation and this appetite of millennials to have experiences nowadays. Yes, well, we have seen particularly throughout the time post the recession and post the financial crash that millennials have continued to eat out. And I think one of the things is that when they've got disposable income, they want value for experience. And that's what our sector is continuing to give them in different ways, whether that's street food markets, nightclubs, different types of entertainment. It's the experience they value and it's our people who deliver that. And are there innovations on the horizon that will make that even more so? Yes, I think that's where automation, robotics, AI in our sector is really freeing up the frontline staff who work in our venues to deliver that better experience to the customers when they arrive. Can you tell me a bit more about your key customer then? Would you say that you rely on millennials or is it the older generation or is it a bit of everything? It's everything and I think that's the beauty of UK hospitality. There is a place for everybody to go, whether you want a quiet cup of coffee or a, a drink with girls and friends families, there is something for everybody and that's what I think the longevity of the UK hospitality industry and its continued growth is down to. And it's not just about enjoying the hospitality, is it? It's the fact that UK hospitality is a key driver for growth in this country and if you think about the industry and the work opportunities it creates, it, it, it's very important to us. It is. It's crucial locally and nationally as a contributor to UK PLC, as I said, 5% of GDP, 1% um, of all UK investment comes from our sector. So you're seeing huge regeneration in our high streets, our town centres over the last five years as a result of growth in hospitality. And it's outperforming the marketplace and the economy overall. And in terms of jobs, it's generated one in six of all new jobs over the last 10 years. Um, and at times when we've reached our peak, it's one in three. So our message is quite clear. If you free us up to deliver, we can deliver great experiences for customers and fantastic job opportunities for UK. And just lastly, traditionally, the opportunities for work within your industry are seen as very short term, aren't mm. they? But actually, there is a much longer prospect for those who've got bigger ambitions. There is. I think it's an ultimate meritocracy, our sector. You can start behind the bar and you can go to the boardroom in a very short period of time. And we've got lots of examples of people who have done just that, myself included. And you've got jobs that are at high skill and are incredibly varied. So yes, for those people who just want to come in, have a short term job, but we'll give them life experiences and business experiences that are valuable in terms of transferable skills, that's fine. But we will also take you as far as you want to go. Well, it's been a great pleasure talking to you. Thank you very much for coming in. Thank you.